hare dale no sleep no nothing ke hare baba lege ena re baba ni we make money sir ke patala ta patala ta namba ta ka za ma za ka ba tla ba ka ba ka ba ka ga ma tsa tapo tsa za la tsa ka dia pa ga ma ha ke tla ga ba ma ka tse ke tsa ka fa ka fa ka namba go tlo thata fa ha ka bitsa se ka la ka lo tlele tlo tlo go fa go tlelele lo tlhe bo tlelele le tlo ba ta ga so ke sele se se lele se ra pa se ba ka ka to ta a le kana ka na wa pa za ma ka na ka mi no o na ra nya tsana re na ga na re di tsa go tlhokiwa le le ba ka la go tlalo sa ma tsa re tsositse fela re sa ne wa le no na le ba ready for whatever no le ha di pala tse di kala <laughs> what now <Ooh. laughs> <laughs> My, oh wow wow hey that gave me the gooseies man ah, that gave me the gooseies indeed yeah, yeah. How, how how are you finding how are you finding the the hip-hop uh, scene i think uh we well, certainly 2014 was a big year for hip-hop 2015 has also been a big year as well we've seen beef uh, all over the place yeah. but also we see a lot of sales as well so let us just in the game how are you finding it um i'm really happy of where hip-hop is going now mm -hmm. And I'm very happy that I'm part of the movement, Yamutako, and hip hop overall. Yeah. So, as a female artist, for me, I'd say I'm very happy that they're also giving us a chance to show that we can also rap, you know, because it's a male dominated genre. So, people, how do you take you serious? And I'm happy that South Africa is giving the ladies that chance to also, you know, step up into the stage and, you know, do their thing. So, yeah. so far, so good. I'm happy, man. We're getting somewhere. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is it is it uh, that the the platform or the chance has been given to you, or have you just put up your hand and said, "Hey, we we've been here. <laughs> Listen, you know." No, man, it takes hard work, really. I've been rapping for eight years, but I've been in my game because I'm one person. I always want to learn what goes in and out of the entertainment industry. It's not about just being behind the mic and rapping or writing music. It's mm -hmm. about knowing what's going on. You know, the marketing, the PR. I don't know what to do with you, so you need to be clever, you know. So I've been learning those type of things. And I decided to move to Joburg this year because I believe that 2015 is 2050. That's why I'm here. Nice. 2050. Yeah. I like that yeah. indeed. Well, let's talk about, uh, I suppose, rap music in its entirety and the misogyny, though, right, mm -hmm. which still persists, persists even to this day, even, even though there are more women in the game. But you still have a lot of women who also... Uh, listen and, and, and enjoy and support and buy very misogynistic music. Mm. Yeah, that is the case. But you know, the thing is that the entire world is